Hello, thank you very much for clicking this video. In the last video, I introduced you to JavaScript and I said JavaScript is a programming language. Before I start teaching you JavaScript, you must know what is actually a programming language. Now I will explain what programming language is in a simple manner. So let's begin. Hello, I am Ali Hossain. I am a web developer and in this channel, I speak about web development and productive coding. If you feel this is something interesting to you, consider subscribing. Hit the like button if this video is helpful. First thing first, what is a programming language? Think of a programming language as a set of rules and comments that you use to tell a computer what to do. It's like giving instruction to a computer in a language it understands. Just as people speak different languages, computers understand different programming languages. When you write code in a programming language, you are essentially telling the computer how to perform a specific task. Whether it's solving a math problem, building a web pages or playing a game. So, programming languages are the tools we use to communicate with computers and making them do what we want. You may ask me, why can't computer understand English? Computers are made of many tiny switches that can be either on or off. When a switch is on, it means one and when a switch is off, it means zero, meaning computer only understand one and zero. There are three types of programming language, machine language, assembly language, as well as high level language. So what is machine language? Machine language is easier for computer to understand, but harder for programmer to understand. This is because machine language is simply the languages for machines. Sometimes programmers will develop programs directly with machine code, but because this is difficult to understand and tedious of type, it is more common to program using assembly or a high level language. So what is assembly language? Assembly language is slightly easier to understand. The bits of machine language are replaced by numbers and English comments. Before assembly code is run by by a computer, it is assembled by a assembler. This converts the code back into ones and zeros of machine language that computer can understand. So what is high level programming language? High level languages use many more English comments and are significantly more readable than assembly or machine language. Many high level languages have built in comments that helps the programmer to write loops, functions, mathematics and more. Some newer high level programming languages are scripting languages. This means they are not compiled or translated as machine language until just before the code executed at runtime. Python, JavaScript, PHP, Ruby and Bash all are scripting languages. On the basics of this level of abstraction, you can say there is two type of programming language, low level language and high level language. What are low level languages? They are also called machine level language. Machine can easily understand it. Debugging them is very difficult. They are not very easy to understand. All the languages come with complex maintenance. They always require assembles for translating instructions. Low level languages do not have a very wide application in today's time. What are high level programming languages? One can easily interpret and combine those languages as compared to the low level languages. They are very easy to understand. Such languages are programmers friendly. Debugging is not very difficult compared to low level language. They are comes with easy maintenance simple and manageable. One can easily run them on different platforms. They require a compiler interpreter for translate into a machine code. I think now you have a very good understanding about programming language, what a programming language is and why it exists. Also, JavaScript is a high level programming language, meaning it's easy to learn. If you want to make your career in web development, then JavaScript is a must for you. I believe this video is helpful for you. What do you think about this video? Don't forget to let me know in the comment. If you are new here, consider subscribing. Thanks for watching. Have a good day and stay safe. I am Ali Hossain signing out.